This is where all of the training pays off. My first time flying solo in the clouds. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love this. This is amazing. Bedwoodell traffic, it can't count final for runway 014 stop, Bedwoodell. As I build hours towards my commercial rating, I'm trying to keep my flying as meaningful as possible, and I try to find missions behind every flight. My parents had been house-sitting for my brother in Madison, so I took the opportunity to fly out there to meet them for breakfast at the jet room. After we ate, I repositioned to the Baraboo Dells Airport to stamp my Wisconsin Airport's passport, and that's where this video really begins. Okay, well, Baraboo Dells traffic, can't get clear of all runways. Taxing to the fuel pump, Baraboo Dells. Baraboo Dells traffic, Cherokee 15601 is taking off runway 1, will be IFR out to the east, Baraboo Dells. After receiving my IFR clearance and release over the phone, I took off from the Dells and headed back home. Hey, I see one, that's what I told him. Heels on the floor. Take off power set and achieve. These are good, airspeed's alive. Cross them from the right. Temperatures and pressures green, more right rudder. 75 by the thousand footers. Baraboo Dells traffic, Cherokee 15601 just departed runway 1, turning out to the east, Baraboo Dells. Madison departure, Cherokee 15601, 2300 off the Dells, direct waste. Alright, 15601 Madison, approach IDENT, Madison, now Timbers 305, uh, 3049 er IDENT 3049, Cherokee 601. 601, direct our contact over the Dells, climb maintain 5000. Climb maintain 5000, Cherokee 601. I had originally filed for 7,000 feet to try to get above the clouds and the turbulence that I had experienced earlier in the day. Clearance and departure both stopped me at 5,000, which ended up being a blessing in disguise later in this flight. Air 15601, change to my frequency 120.1. Cherokee 15601 up on 120.1. Thank you. All right, looking like we might be getting some IMC here. Time to go to work. Weber 289er, turn right, heading into 40. Right to 240, Roma Tiger, Trade Trade Approach 62 Sierra request. 62 Sierra, say request. Yeah, any chance of uh, using the Madison VOR for uh, practice holds if we stay up high here at 7500? Approved as request, 60 sure. 60 is here, thanks. Uh, yeah, we'll probably be using my 360 radio. Yeah, 33 Delta's radar contact, 1 2 miles southeast of Madison Airport, Madison Altimeters, 3049. Yeah, three Mike Zulu on navigation, right down one runway three, contact tower one one nine zero point three. Have a good day. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love this. This is amazing. Yeah, 
Uh, three three Delta Raider, sir. Terminate the cross depot. Bring you change approved. You have a good day. Three three change approved. Thank you much. Seven, three three Delta. After endless hours of early mornings of training, my persistence had finally paid off. I had flown through the clouds on my own. Eventually, the clouds lifted and I descended, but the thrill and serenity that I had experienced stuck with me for long after. November 601, contact Milwaukee approach 125.35. 2535, and it's been uh, a light chop, occasional monitor turbulence of 5,000. Minus two, negative icing, and uh, have a good day, 601. Roger, you too. Hiwas information may be obtained on flight service frequency 122.65. Advise on initial contact, you have information, Lima. Milwaukee, good morning, Cherokee 15601, 5000 with Lima. Now 15601, Milwaukee approach, visual altimeter is 3049 Earth. You can expect visual approach runway 10 at Waukesha, you said Lima. We do have Lima, 3049er, we'll expect the visual 10, Cherokee 15601. 601, you can proceed direct Waukesha. Direct Waukesha, 601. Set a flight plan. Jedi uh, Schwarzer, no, just still on the 5000 or a bit of high goon. Uh, yes. Approach Cherokee 601, when it helps, field in sight. Cherokee 601, cleared visual approach, only 10, Waukesha, Raider Services, terminate contact the tower on 123.7. Quick visual approach 10 over to tower. You enjoy your day, Cherokee 601. Waukesha Tower, good afternoon, Cherokee 15601, about 12 to the west, visual 10. Cherokee 15601, Waukesha Tower, runway 10, clear to land, wind 0, 608. Clear to land 10, Cherokee 15601. Alright, autopilot's coming off, we're going to hand fly. Okay, gas efficient fuel, undercarriage, down, welded. Mixture is full, rich, prop is full, forward. Seat belts are on, switches are on. Three mile final, we're clear to land. 500. We are cleared to land. Aircraft is configured, we're stable. Approach. Sufficient fuel, fuel pump on, mixture's rich, prop pull forward, we're ready for the go. 500. 500 checks. It's said that flying is the second greatest thrill known to man, but landing is the first. After today, I'd say it's a pretty close tie. Kilo, continue northeast bound, and you make free shades. Timmy, your discretion, good day. Good day, uh, 459 Kilo, thanks. Hey, good afternoon, Washtenaw Tower, 459 or Mike, we have Lima, visual, runway 10. Legacy 459 or Mike, Boxhead Tower, good afternoon, runway 10, clear to land, wind 0601, 4. Clear land, uh, 060 at 14, 590 Mike, thanks. Going back to southeast, Tangers. You know it's 601. 601, you stand and run right through the intersection, turn right at Charlie, and then taxi to parking, just monitor ground point six. All the way down to Charlie, and uh, we'll monitor ground point six to park. Cherokee 15601, you enjoy your day. You too. Every flight is an opportunity to grow as a pilot, and this one was no different. The emotions I felt after shutting down the plane were similar to those of my first solo as a private pilot student, and it left me thinking about the past and the future. This inspired me to go back to the Capitol Drive Airport for my next flight and relive my student pilot days in November 9 or 6, 14 Whiskey. Then it was back into the club Skyhawk to work on landing a plane from the right seat. Those videos are coming soon, but until then, 
Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time on The Badger Pilot.